Hey guys, so welcome to Vlogtober day six. Um, so I decided I'm gonna do something different instead of one of those like follow me around kind of vlogs. I was gonna do a tag, which I mentioned that maybe some days for Vlogtober I won't have like regular, I won't have, <laughs> I won't do like, you know, vlogging kind of stuff. I would do maybe some tags or whatever kind of, you know, videos. Um, yeah. I'm super hot right now because I can't open the window because Louie wants to escape and I'm on the third floor so <laughs> if he tries to get out the window he's just gonna end up falling really far anyways today I'm gonna do the I heart fall tag um, I decided it was kind of appropriate because it is October and we are in fall um, so yeah <laughs> what is your favorite fall lip product so my favorite fall lip product is ah car mix um i love that i use that all year round but especially in the winter um to keep any kind of dry flaky lips at bay um yeah it's really good it has spf it heals um yeah so that's my favorite lip product um for fall and for all year round lipstick wise i like to go towards like darker colors or nude colors so i like dark washes like dark berries or dark brown um, wine colors like really dark um, but I also do like wearing my red lipstick too <laughs> um, yeah what is your favorite fall nail polish when it comes to nail polish for the fall um, I would stick to darker colors but I do stay within like certain colors that I like like purple I wear all year round but I might wear a little bit more darker shades during the fall um, like for instance this is one this is OPI's Hmm. can't let go OPI's can't let go um, it's a liquid sand nail polish and I got this in a glossy box um, either last year or this year early this year I can't remember exactly but um, yeah I like purple shades like these um, or maybe something like this like a darker blue I wear a lot of blues and purples and blacks and reds <laughs> but that's actually not so much reds until like Christmas comes but like blues and purples and blacks I'll wear more um, during the fall. So my favorite fall Starbucks drink um, I don't really think that it really has anything to do with the kind of season because I drink coffee any <laughs> all the um, all year round, but um, I Guess I'll get I'll get a soy cappuccino um, And before I was vegan I used to like around this time to get um, a Starbucks has like a pumpkin loaf and it tastes like delicious <laughs> It's so good um, but I can't have it anymore, but I used to get that with a cappuccino, with, um, the regular cappuccino. Um, yeah. <laughs> My favorite fall candle. Um, I don't normally, I've just started getting into candles. Like last Christmas, around that time, I bought some candles. I bought some candles earlier this year. But, um, I haven't bought any kind of fall scented candles. So, the only candle that I can think of that's, I mean, I guess it's maybe kind of Christmassy, but it's still cold weather-ish. Um, I really, really, really love Frosted Cranberry. I got this last Christmas. <sighs> it smells so good. <laughs> it smells so good. It smells like candy. Like, I'm not a really big fan of anything that's like sweet smelling, like cakes and cupcakes and vanilla type of scents. I don't really care for those scents because I think after a while it gets sort of overpowering, but scents like these that are fruity oh my god I could <laughs> I could smell them all day so yeah I guess my favorite fall scent would be frosted cranberry even though it's kind of like a Christmas sea scent but I like fruity smells <laughs> my favorite fall scarf or accessory I like scarves like these like this is just like a pashmina and this one's a, a purple and black one and I have different ones in different colors with different patterns. So I like a lot of pashminas. I end up buying a whole bunch of these because they're really cheap. I feel like every single time I'm taping one of these videos, I guess it's been a while since I've taped like, you know, the camera on a tripod that I feel like out of breath. But every time I tape these kind of videos, I feel out of breath. I don't know. <sighs> so my favorite fall accessory would have to be hats. I don't know. Do hats count as accessories? They do, right? Yeah. Um, I'm obsessed with hats. I love hats so much. I love scarves so much. So like when it gets cold outside, I'm ready to put on a hat. 
I've already brought out a couple hats already <laughs> in September. Haunted corn maze, haunted house, or haunted hayride. Um, I've never been on a haunted hayride or on a haunt or through a haunted corn maze. And I don't really think I've ever been to a, like an actual haunted house. Like I've been to like little kitty haunted houses, but not like a full blown, like really big haunted house. So, I don't know, but I guess if I had to pick one, I'd rather go on the haunted corn maze. Like, if it was really scary, I think that would be really fun. A hayride would probably be really cool, too. But, um, yeah, I don't like the haunted houses because I don't like people jumping out at me and scaring me. I do get scared pretty easily. <laughs> So, I'd rather do the con the haunted um, corn maze where I'll feel like, I don't know, I could just make believe that I'm looking for the Triwizard Cup and I'm trying to find my way out. <laughs> and if it's like really dark and scary and I'm picturing fog, but I guess that wouldn't really happen all the time. But if it was like that, then yeah, I would pick that one. My favorite Halloween movie is actually Halloween Town. I love that movie. Um, yeah. If you don't know Halloween Town, it's like a Disney movie, and it's just, I don't know, it's like lighthearted, and I just like it. It makes me feel happy, <laughs> so I like Halloween Town. I do like Hocus Pocus, but Hocus Pocus, I, it's more of like, I don't want to say it's like super serious. I mean, it's I guess it, it is more of a serious movie compared to Hocus Pocus, I mean to Halloween Town, but um, I just like the lightheartedness of Halloween Town, and I don't know, something about the colors or something makes me happy. I don't know. I guess I'm very simple that way. <laughs> Favorite Halloween candy? Man, I haven't eaten Halloween candy in years. But, um, I'm trying to think. I guess when I used to go trick-or-treating, my favorite candies were, I don't know what they're called, but they're like these fruit chews that I know they don't sell them individually. You have to get them in like packs. And they come in like different flavors. They're like small little like wrapped ones. I don't know, like that? I don't know what the names are. I don't know what it's called. Or, I used to like anything chocolate related. So, any chocolate <laughs> candy that they would give in like, the you know, for trick-or-treaters, I used to like that. But, um, other than that, I don't really eat any candy anymore for Halloween. It's, I don't know. I'm not into candy anymore. And I'll eat chocolate, but it's not, I don't know. It's not a big thing. There's not a thing that I really eat when it comes to fall. What are you dressing up as for Halloween? Um, I'm not really sure what I want to dress up as. I like having more than one costume um, for different days, not for the same day. But, um, yeah, I like... I was thinking about a vampire, but then I don't want to be like a Twilight vampire. I want to be like a Buffy vampire, you know, that kind of vampire. And then I'm thinking about maybe I want to be a cat. <laughs> I was thinking about that today. I don't know why. I don't know. I guess I was I was bonding with my cat and you know. I don't know. I don't know. I thought about a cat too. Or I thought about a witch. I do want to be a witch, but I don't know. Like I don't know what kind of witch I would be. Like I think I'd want to be a scary witch, but I don't want to be like, you know, just a standard green witch that everybody wants to be when they're scary. Like I want to be a cool witch, but I just I'm not sure. I'm not sure. <laughs> What's your favorite thing about fall? My favorite thing about fall Honestly, it has to be the fact that I get to wear boots, hats, scarves, jackets, and um, Halloween. I Oh, and Thanksgiving and Black Friday. There's a lot of things, actually. Oh, I love Halloween. Halloween is my... Not technically a holiday, I think, right? But I think it's like my number one favorite holiday, oh, not holiday. Favorite. Yeah, so I like... Thanksgiving obviously for the food. I love cooking a whole bunch of food. I love that there's a ton of food that everybody's making and um, pumpkin pie and sweet potato pie are like very close to my heart. And um, I love that the next day after that you have Black Friday because I love Black Friday. Um, if you guys don't know what Black Friday is, I don't know if they have it. I don't think they have it everywhere. But Black Friday over here is the day after Thanksgiving um, in America. We have, like, there's a bunch of stores, well, I think all stores end up having huge sales, um, which really they have the same sales at Christmas time, but I don't know. 
I don't know. <laughs> so I'm I like shopping and I like that. All right, so that's it. That's the ends of my I Heart fall tag. Hopefully you enjoyed it, and if you want to see more kind of videos like these, I could do them um, instead of, you know, the other type of vlogs for the month. Um, yeah, now I'm going to go and watch Revenge and The Witches of East End. East End, I think? Yeah, I think so. It's a new show. And relax, like I said. So I'll see you guys tomorrow for day seven and don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Everything is in the down bar and um, if you want to keep up with me, you can check out my Instagram and my Twitter. I have all the information in the down bar below. Um, yeah, so I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. What are you doing? Hmm? Harassing my life? Is that what you're doing? <gasps> don't you dare mess up my chapstick.